Hello and welcome back to Death Must Die. Everyone knows this game. Everyone loves this game. This game is so popular. Everyone wants to watch this game. Just kidding. Just kidding. I don't know what the fuck is going on anymore with my life. Oh, that's my dog. Some say J Dog. They say J Dog. They said. They said. What's the dog doing? I'll be honest with you. Don't know what the dog doing. She's staring outside, staring at the people walk across the street. People say, J-Dog, why the dog doing that? Is she the dog? Talk canines, right? Canis lupus. That's the wolf. What do I know about Canis lupus? What do you know about Canis lupus? When my time comes, life shivers and hides. How can the living appreciate my beauty with his scythe above them? Whoa, bro, she's hot. Oh, man. I'm scared and horny, bro. What? <laughs> I'm bugging with you. I'm bugging with you. I think I am. No, Candace Lupus, all right? Wolves. What do we know about wolves? Wolves are the coolest creature on the planet. That is not that is not my opinion, that's a fact, alright? They're cooler than everything else. Okay, that is my opinion. You know, I lied to you, I'm sorry. Lagon, god of lightning, at your service. Strange. This opening usually shocks mortals at least a little. Some have beat me to it, right? Unbefitting of a god to be unpunctual, especially one such as myself. Never mind, that's quite like me, actually. No one can predict the lightning bolt. Look at this asshole. He's a fucking dick. He was a dick. <laughs> nah, but dude, I don't know what the fuck I'm on. Canis Lupus. All right, wolves. Did you know there's Mexican wolves? This is a thing. They go. They say, hey, Mark. They're, they say, Lobo. What is Lobo? Lobo is wolves in Spanish. That's how you say it. It's, I think it's, yeah, it's wolf in Spanish. Isn't it? There's, dude, there's wolves everywhere. They got they got wolves in in the north. You got wolves in the south. You got wolves on the equator. You got you got wolves in China. You got wolves in America. They're everywhere. There's wolves all across the planet. And what do wolves do? I don't know. You know what's stupid? You know what really grinds my gears? Dogs and wolves are considered carnivores, but they're they they have they're omnivores. They can eat fucking plants, bro. But people people classify them as carnivores. Greetings to you, champion. They're weak. I am the arbiter of justice. It is a pleasure to finally meet. Death has wronged both your kind and mine, and for this he must face the law. Will you help me carry out the sentence? Light rays, radiance, divine shield. I don't know what the fuck's going on. But we're winning. Light rays casting. We only get one cast. We got we got 18 strike skills. Holy cow. Holy bejeebus. But yeah, there's wolves everywhere, bro. And they do different things. Do I know how it works? Nope, I'm not a wolf. What you know about werewolves, hmm? Hmm? Now listen, there's this theory, okay, that I got. It's my personal theory, alright? So, so you got werewolves and you got vampires and zombies and ghouls and shit. You got all this, all this weird, crazy stuff. Frankenstein, okay. And then you get, you can get a little bit more like um, into the mythological creatures. Hear me out. Hear me out. Uh, you got minotaurs, griffins, fucking dragons. All right, you know, I hear me out, bro. What if, what if all those crazy things that people believe are myth or fake are not real were at least once upon a time real? You know what I'm saying? Like, how would people have the ideas that this thing exists without it actually having existed? People think that they're all fake, but I don't think that's quite true. People be like, oh, well, uh, fucking help you. Well, we're not fake, exactly yeah. helping you. It's your own fate. We're the ones sewing it. We're just uh, lending an eye, if you will. 
Hear me out, bro. Hear me out. So, all right, you you know what a hippocampus is? A hippocampus is it's 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 a mythological creature also known as a seahorse, all right? Now, when I say seahorse, I don't mean the seahorse. The hippocampus is like literally a sea horse. It's got the head of a horse and the bottom part of the sea animal, all right? What the fuck is a hippocampus, brother? Now, there's two things I want to point out about the hippocampus, all right? Do you know which god in Greek mythology is attributed with having created the horse, the land animal? Because you'd be surprised to know that it's Poseidon, the god of the seas. Why the hell did Poseidon make a land animal? Well, guess what? He made it after the hippocampus. Which, guess the fuck what? It's a seahorse, my dude. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You're not listening to me. So, hear me out. Hear me out. If Poseidon made the horse after the hippocampus, which is the seahorse, then that would mean logically that creatures were made from the god's vision. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I got another take. I got another take. Do you know there's a part of your brain, if you're in science, you might know this, if you didn't know that about mythology. There's a part of your brain, guess what it's called? It's called the hippocampus. Do you know why that, that part of your brain is called the hippocampus? That you don't know why it's called the hippocampus because it's shaped like the mythical creature the hippocampus see see you didn't know that now you know logically speaking the hippocampus was a real creature before it was a mythical creature that's all i'm saying wait it was always it's, it's always been real and mythical Everything that was a mythical creature was once real. Okay, take take the centaur, for example. This is one of my favorite examples. People say that the centaur is the easiest creature to, to like, verify based upon, like, it being fake, right? If you just have a dude on the back of a horse and you just see a silhouette, you'd be like, oh, that's a man horse. It's not a dude on a horse. What That assumption makes no damn sense because people just go on horses. So why would you just assume that it's a man horse and not assume it's a man on a horse? What makes more sense is somebody saw a man horse and they said, damn, what the fuck? It's a man horse. I'm just saying. Garbage. Chain lightning is all I have going for me. I'm fucking garbage. That's what she said. This hot babe with the two daggers that's just going called me trash. I'm just saying. Look, I got a lot of the Cyclops. Cyclops, you know, there's a there's a disease that gives you that you're born with one eye. I forget what it's called. It's probably not that hard to find though. If you could find that disease. And you search uh, the disease name and you say centered, it gives you a Cyclops. I'm not even playing with you, a real Cyclops. I'm being serious. You fucking suck. We lost in nine minutes. We're just gonna go again. Is she trying to talk to me? Do you think we can beat death? They got emojis, they got emoticons. A conversation. Suri! I'm out of those. Oh, I'm fucking, I'm a fucking, no, I'm a bitch. Yo, what did I lose? I don't have any damage. What's this shrine doing? War totem. Who knows? This game reminds me of like a, uh, like an action RPG, you know what I'm saying? Like Diablo or something? But it's better than Diablo 4. Everybody hates that game. What's wrong with Diablo 4? Dude, it's garbage. You haven't played it? You doing all right there, mortal? I think you could really use some of my godly aid. 
Wouldn't you agree? This guy's a dick, bro. Fuck that guy. Your attacks become stronger and have a chance to trigger an additional attack. Yes. I'm fucking buzzing, buzzing. What was I saying? Ah, who knows? I'm, I'm the master of forgetting what the hell I was talking about. Anybody else do that? Nah, just me? Ah, we are. You know what it is? It's probably because you don't talk to yourself for hours on end while staring at a picture of moving images. That's definitely what it is. I have no doubt in my mind that's what it is. It is not for death to decide when to take a life. For breaking his duty towards the living, he must face retribution. Reprisal. Whenever an enemy starts attacking you, it's dog shit. We just did it. On cooldown, you gain a shield that prevents the next time you take damage. I'll take that one. The best defense is a good offense, I always say. It's true, isn't it? If an enemy is dead, they can't hurt you. That's why when we play video games, uh, we play PvP video games, you just build a glass cannon. If you can kill the enemy before they kill you, then uh, you win. But if you build tank and you can't kill the enemy, but they can kill you, you lose. See what I'm saying? Shrine of music? Oh my god. Gain, uh, gain 1,200 pull area? What is this, lady? Talk to the witch? Do you want this disgusting looking soup, mortal? Must be getting rather hungry being down here. The soup really does look disgusting. Drink the soup with your chance to gain a random blessing or become cursed. I'm fucking cursed! What does that even mean? The path to victory is littered with the fallen. I have a summon? Blood swords? You're attacking shuriken? Oh boy. I love strikes. Holy cow, I'm a shuriken master? I'm a fucking ninja, dog. Archon helmet? Like, like XCOM 2 Archon? Does anybody or anybody been here for a while? See my, uh, see my XCOM 2 playthrough on them YouTubes? That was a long ass playthrough. I think it took me 30 hours to beat that game. That's crazy. I don't want to upgrade this stupid shield. I don't even like it. Shields. You know what I think? Modern warfare is all fucked up. All right, medieval warfare was simple. Okay, you have a sword to attack. You have a shield to defend. And some people would forego the shield for two swords. All right, now you have two. Now you have two attackers. All right. Then people would be like, okay, I don't want a shield. I want. I want a big weapon like a maul. Like, look at this guy. See this dude? He's got a maul. Okay. He's got ideas. But what I'm saying is that in modern warfare, there's no shields. Nobody, nobody has shields. Strike your attacks. Hit your attack hits have a chance to create a chain that rotates around you for a limited time. Let's do it. In in modern warfare, there's no there's no blocking. You look at the fucking riot shield. Like the riot shield was invented for riots, not for combat. And when you play freaking when you play Call of Duty Modern Warfare and you see a guy running with a riot shield, he's fucking playing games, bro. He ain't being for real. Shit don't work. Strike, change up war upgrade. There's no modern shields and it's so weird. Like, okay, okay, hear me out, hear me out, right? hear me out, hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. If somebody launches an ICBM at you, intercontinent ballistic missile, how are you gonna defend yourself? You aren't gonna defend yourself. What you're gonna do is die. You're gonna explode and that's it. All right? People go, oh, well, J-Dog, there's, there's land to air anti-missiles. Does that make any fucking sense to you? So, okay, there's a projectile falling from the sky, coming at me at an incredibly high speed, and I'm gonna shoot a missile at it and shoot it down. No, that don't make no damn sense. I'm just saying. What you should do is you throw a shield up. Your bubble shield, you know what I'm saying? Why don't we have bubble shields yet? Okay, peep this one. 
You see this dude? You see this guy holding two shields that looks like a that looks like a face? Why don't we just fucking toss a metallic object at it to block it and make it explode in the air? Hmm? What's wrong with that idea? Why don't we have shields in Modern Warfare? We got armor. Bruh, have you seen Kevlar? I saw I saw a video, all right? There's this dude that I have discovered. He does modern archery. I don't know what you know about modern archery. These are all trash. But I don't know what you know about archery in general, okay? But there are two different types of bows that you can use in modern archery. You have a you have a, a, a compound bow and a recurve bow. All right, you know, there's probably more. Right? I'm fucking stupid. But those are the two standard types that I currently am aware of. Some dude watching this video definitely has more knowledge than me on standard bow and arrows, all right? What I'm trying to tell you, though, is that a recurve bow uses a pulley system, and pulley systems are like magic. Nobody knows how they work. But a recurve bow, or a compound bow, uses a pulley system, and, like, I can take 50 pounds of force and convert it into 150 pounds of force. Just with some fucking little circles. But a recurve bow doesn't work like that. A recurve bow is just all my force. So this dude... I should probably find his name. This dude's got fucking... He pulls and shoots 150 pound recurve bows. And he tested it against modern armor. That recurve bow went to the first three stages of modern armor. Like the first stage being a, a Kevlar vest. And the last stage just being a fucking inch thick plate of metal. And the arrows went through everything except for that inch long thick plate of metal armor. Metal? metal? It's just a fucking piece of metal. Allow me to interfere as guards typically do. Oh, I'm saying. What's, what's, what, 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 what's with all this bullshit? You feel me? Where's my modern tower shield? that blocks bullets how come i can't block bullets people are all concerned about all these shootings bro and guns well why well, how come nobody has invented defense for it there's a million dollar idea somebody invent a deployable shield that'll automatically deploy when a certain decibels is reached and it'll protect the entire person from a bullet Because when a gun, when a gun, all right, so gun, gun go pow, bullet comes out of the gun, okay? Well, before the projectile is launched from the gun, guess what? It makes a loud ass fucking noise because the gunpowder. Take advantage of that, have a decibel sensor, and if the decibels exceed X amount, then this bad boy, this defensive object is going to automatically deploy. In fact, you could even set it up to where hear me out you can set it up to where this object deploys in the direction that the sound was made because it is sound bro it comes from a direction you should be able to determine what direction it came from chain lightning there's your defensive object dog not not just not just give me a fucking bubble shield Up 1%. Damage goes sky high, though. On these tornadoes. Do you see what you... Are you picking up what I'm putting down? Are you listening to me? I have now just theoretically invented an object that can provide modern defense against bullets. You know why it doesn't exist? Because nobody's bothered to make it yet. They're too busy dying to bullets. Like I said, the best defense is a good offense. They said, oh, let's just put sand in a fucking t-shirt, and then that's going to block a bullet. That ain't doing shit, bro. Doing nothing. For you to block that bullet, what you need to do is you got to get a piece of armor, okay? You got to fucking get some night suits. I'm sick of modern technology. I'm sick of these guns. I'm not even a gun hater. I just like them because I don't like them because how boring they are. 
That shit looks boring. Bro, have you shot a gun? That shit is magic. There's no other way to describe a gun. It's just magic. Shard Polaria? Attack speed? Holy cow. Give me that. 14 life. Ouch. Bullets are magic. I went to the gun range, alright? I shot my ass a gun. My experience in shooting that gun, I, I pulled a gun out. I aim it down the firing range. I, I put it at a target. I, point, I press the trigger, okay? The recoil makes my hands go up. I can't see the hole, right? I pull the gun down, and I look at where I was aiming, and there's a fucking hole. That's magic. They're too easy. They're boring. I want to see somebody pull a 150-pound recurve bow and then shoot somebody else in the head, right? That should be modern warfare, you know what I'm saying? Instead, I've been seeing these videos of, of medieval combat, all right, modern medieval combat, where they just use fucking styrofoam fucking armor and or styrofoam weapons and, like, some plastic armor. And I'm like, what the fuck is this? You're telling me with modern technology where we literally, like, we can automate smithing? We could, we could shove a bunch of metal in a machine and it can just cast swords? It's automation, my dude. With this kind of tech, we fucking, we can't even just... Like, make cool things? Why do we make shit out of plastic? You could just make a casting mold for a fucking piece of metal armor and you could just make it. En masse. That said. That said. One size fits all is not... One size fits all has never been a thing when it came to the medieval world. With exception to, like, swords. And, like, shields. Any, any level of armor normally has to be tailored to an individual. It's true. I don't know if you knew that or not, but it's true. We love medieval tech. Everybody loves medieval technology. Everybody said, they said, everybody said, why are we using this stupid shit? We should be using medieval technology. You gain attack speed for each ruptured enemy. Oh my god. Your attacks have a chance to create ch fucking spinners. Oh my god. Not sure, again, sorry to tell you. I want a sword, bro. I got a I bought a, I bought a sword. True story. It's not, look, it's not a metal sword. It's a plastic sword. It's, I was gonna buy a wooden sword, but I couldn't fucking, they don't exist, all right? I just bought it on Amazon. If you want anything exotic, you gotta go to Amazon. They sell chain armor on Amazon. I bought that bad boy too. And then I wore it to, a, to an event and they had a metal detector. And the guy goes, why are you wearing that? If we're being honest with each other, the answer was for fucking defense, all right? If somebody pulls out a shiv and tries to stab my ass, I'm fucking protected. But if I told them that it was for defense, they wouldn't have let me in because that's just the way people work. So I lied to his ass and I said, it keeps me warm. He goes, how does it keep you warm? I said, the extra weight on my body, it provides me with, it makes my body work harder so it produces more heat. So they just let me in. Wearing a fucking full set of chainmail on my chest piece. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with them. I could have taken it off and just beat the shit out of somebody with it and just killed them. Whatever's wrong with them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That wasn't safe. To be fair, it wasn't a weapon, though. You said, j Dog, what kind of event did you go to that required you to go through a metal detector? You see, friend, I live in this really cool place that everybody's called America. And you see, in America, people like guns. And they like to kill people with guns. Holy fucking shit. I got rope. What does this do? It's a belt piece. I need a compare button. Movement speed is so much better than armor in life. Give me that. I was going, it was a, it was a haunted house event. Like, it was a haunted house called the Niles Scream Park. 
Oh my gosh, I'm a fucking insane man. Yeah. But honestly, I can't even I can't even believe they would fucking ask me why I wear a piece of chainmail. There's just one kid that I knew he wore a piece of chainmail to school. All right? And people were like, "Why are you wearing a piece of chainmail to school?" Gain minus 30 evasion. I'll take it. And when the kid responded, he was like, he just started going on about the defensive properties of chainmail. And when I heard about this, I wasn't there. I wasn't. I wasn't active. My response was, of course he went on about the defensive properties of chainmail. He's not gonna tell you the real fucking reason he decided to wear chainmail to school. What's the real reason? That's just fucking cool as fuck. Who wouldn't want to wear chainmail to school? Are you fucking kidding me? I would want to wear chainmail to school. After dashing, there's a chance you gain a status that gives you increased attack chance triggers on your next attack. What? Oh my gosh. These blue slimes are kicking my ass. An eternity like Sisyphus. Sisyphus? No, his string we keep in the endless chest. Yours is just constantly shifting. That was a piece but... of soda? Well, at least for now, looks finite to me. Can I say that? Can I say piece of soda? Guidance. I'm losing HP fast. I need support. There's something on the ground over here I want to I wanna collect, but I don't know what it is. Lightning! Yup. All I'm trying to tell you is that... Oh, fuck, it's so much better. Is that people wearing chainmail don't wear chainmail for the defensive properties. Obviously, it has defensive properties, and it's never a bad thing not to wear. You know what I'm saying? It'll protect your life. In the event of disaster but what we saying is that it's fucking cool bro who doesn't want to wear chain mail i mean it weighs a crap ton it has obviously has defensive properties maybe he was just trying maybe that kid who was wearing chain mail in class was just trying to train up his body maybe he was doing some weight training oh i'm fucked they're so strong i'm so strong I'm the best to ever do it. Lightning bolts. Bussin' bussin'? Bussin' bussin'. Oh, she's gonna get me. Maybe there's a fountain of youth over here. Volcanic ring? I want that. What does it do? Increased cast critical chance. Weak. Minus. I'm fucking cursed. The Baron's left hand and the Baron's right hand. I remember these dudes. I fought them one time and I won. Not this time though. Oh, I remember that attack. I'm dead. Fucking weak sauce, man. All right, all right, all right, all right. It's fucking, it's like 90 degrees in my room right now, dude. I'm getting closer. How do you do? Go fish someplace else. Happen to carry any cool books up here? Why the fuck would I carry books at the freezing peak of this mountain? You must be fun at parties. Says the bookworm. What the fuck? I'm so fucking mean, bro. I'm a fucking hater, bro. Uh, I'm a fucking hater, bro. Shit. I'm gonna sell everything that's not cool looking. Merchant. I would like to sell this. What is this thing? Weak. Oh, I guess if it has a purple or blue name, you should look at it. Ah, damn. Wasn't there something over here? Bonfire? I'm fucking... I'm Dark Souls? Hold on. That's not right. Is it this one? 
Excuse me, sir. Uh, no. Ah, here we are. Merit. Your strikes deal more damage. Your attack deals increased damage. Yo, these are such a low percentage, bro. I'm pissed. Why can't they be cooler? Next time, we're gonna run, uh, we're gonna run Averon. I need more male characters in my video games. The hourglass worked. I'm back, but I still don't understand why the time has gave us hourglass. The righteousness of our cause. But time's focus must be on more important. I don't know what the fuck he's talking about. I can buy a tortoise of vigor. Whenever you kill an elite enemy, a gold pile drops of 50 gold. I got, I'm fucking loaded, bro. Holy cow. What is this? Equip. This thing's trash. Transfer. We gotta sell that. What's this one? Stat changes if equipped. This thing's trash. Sold. Don't equip that. I lose luck, but I gain life. Luck seems like a very valuable stat. You know what I'm saying? This one should be tossed. We don't care about that. I lose a little bit of DPS, but I gain as it's, it's dog shit. It's dog shit. Sell all this crap. Fucking nasty, bro. I need to be a vendor in real life. I want to be a peddler. That's my dream. Wait, does my chest piece, is that that good? 4.5 more expert offers is insane. I don't have a ring equipped. Summon damage, more adept offers, attack crit chance, more god blessing rarity upgrade. Oh, it's got all this shit. And I don't know nothing. Critical helm of the Archon. Didn't I get one of those? I probably sold that bitch. No question. Buy back. There it is. 46 to buy back. What's this one? This thing's better. Thanks, buddy. Oh, I can I can do their inventory while I'm here. Huh, who knew? Oh. Hello, inventory. It was nice knowing you. Anyways, we're gonna end it right there. I hope you enjoyed. The music in this game could be a little bit stronger, you know what I'm saying? I mean, like... The music could be a little bit better, you know what I'm saying? Alright, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Peace.